Hi, old viewers. Time for episode four of the Probe Racer Build Chronicles of Goodness. Uh, so just recently, as you can see from the wetness down there, and there, that one actually punched a hole in. There isn't there. Anyway, all these places I'm looking at, there was water. Yes. Gobs of water. Gallons of water. Buckets of it. Uh, so I just vacuumed that out. I said put a hole there, which... So we'll see how cool it is. There's such a pro hole. Anyway, I've drained that out. That shouldn't be getting filled up anymore. And we might as... Oh my god. There's a seat missing. That is right. And a bunch of carpet on top of it. You only close this. Ooh. Mm. Ah. Sounds like bones breaking. Ugh, my bones eventually. But I'm actually racing. Press the seat back some so we can get the door open. Anyway, and oh yeah, where is the carpet in the seat? It's not there. It took a while to do that, and it's all moist down here. Eww. There's a lot of more water before I vacuumed it. Um, I already seen the door all removed. So now all we really have left is to get a racing seat, get our cage in, remove that last bit of carpet. Clean some things up. Oh yeah, not him. But anyway, get the uh, sound ending removed because we want to hear this engine in its glory. And that's all there is left. So kind of a short update. Uh, just get a lot of kind of shots here. I step in. Seems like I took a drive the other day yeah, with my homies, and we discovered that the car's heater heat gauge does in fact work. It just takes forever to register, I guess, because it just goes right to a radiator when it starts. So, uh, it takes forever to heat up, which isn't cool, which means I've been running it cold for a long time. Uh, so, but glad that works. Now, all we have to do is get oil pressure working. Good to have in a turbo car, especially an old turbo car that's leaking oil. Uh, <laughs> always nice to have. Anyhow. Yeah, we definitely should take those headlights out. As you've seen, before, we've done the doors and done the back, but look, no carpet, no seat for the entire car now. Not to mention various other bits, like the seatbelt things that were right up along here, and so on. Uh, lots of stuff, pretty much everything's gone now. Uh, the only thing that's left is the seatbelt thing that we can take out. Uh, so if we want to reinstall the seat, we can go somewhere we can. Here's the steering adjust for the assist. Uh, sound deadening mostly gone, and in major news, we've taken out the AC radiator. As you know, the only radiator now is our main one, so now only do we have better airflow, we lose some weight, a few more hoses gone. I was driving the car the other day, and it did overheat or something started. Something was boiling, uh, some cool one, we lost some water, I don't know. Exactly what happened there. The gauge was reading okay temperature. I know we have 13 pound cap on here, so. Here, does that help? Nah. That just looks pretty cheap. We're also gonna make a battery tie down. We figured out what bolt they are. I don't know if you can see it down in there. And yeah, that's I'm about all. Alrighty. Sounds good. Oh, also, make sure to cover everything here. Fog lights out. It's probably gonna take this fan out. Probably think it's linked to the AC directly, so. I doubt it's going to do us any good these days. Look at the side mirror off. So, ready for a roll cage and a seat. And we might do some other various things to tie down, but not too much more. It's not too much more to do. Uh, and then we'll check out the shifter, do the exhaust, the glass, and there won't be that much left. This is Corbin signing off for update part four. Crashing some of the stuff. I just wanted to get. Get a shot of the radiator core. There's my hand on it. Give you an idea of the size. Eh, that doesn't really help, but it's mostly limp, so it's not too heavy. A bunch of copper pipes, all that. Yeah. That mostly just blocked flow. And generally did not help anything or anyone in any significant way, so we took it out. With the seatbelt motors. Assembly, which is being destroyed right now. Thank you.